former Congressman Parker Griffith in the studio with us. It has been a long time, my friend. How are you doing? I'm great. How about yourself? Pretty good. Get a little closer to that mic there, Congressman. It's good to have you on the program again. Oh, what took so long? I have no idea. You guys wouldn't return my call. Oh, yeah. That, what about that? that yeah. That, come on now. Uh, come on. Let's be honest. Come on. Let's be honest. I called you the day I announced, and you wouldn't call me back. That. Oh, you're talking uh, about that? Whoa, 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 Wait. I'm talking about what about the four you, years and prior? And if you did it now, you did it last time. We that, tried to come on over and over again, and you broke your promise every time. That is the most absurd thing I have ever heard in absurd my Absurd thing? That's and, what talk radio's about. Absurd. Oh, oh my. Well, I'm glad we're starting off this way because that is just blatantly absurd. It's untrue. Absurd. Oh, come on now. Congressman, are you trying? You wouldn't know the truth if it ran over you. <laughs> are you, you actually, wouldn't know the are truth. You, you don't tell the truth, Dale. What this is about ratings, man. This is about you making money telling anything you want to tell, whether it's true or not. Like what? Keep talking and I'll No, 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 no. Yeah, hey, listen, I can say, here are some things that you have said. You told me, on. you told your listeners, you okay. told your listeners mm -hmm. that Mo Brooks yeah. did not vote for a tax increase on the middle class. Actually, that's, you're talking about the payroll tax increase? Yeah. The payroll tax cut? We're going to get into that. No, no, no. Let's get into it now. Well, we're gonna, It's H.R. 3630. I got it. My show, though. We're, we're going we're to... No, go no. Off. I'm your guest. Be of nice. Course. Of course. I am being nice. No, no, you're not. You've walked in here from the very talk. beginning and it's said I was talk. a liar. It's my talk. No, no. Your talk is next time. House 6 to 7 30. 3630. Read it. Well, we're going to get into he it. He voted for a tax right. increase on the middle class. Well, He that's... voted it against leadership. All right. Well, you want to get into that? I liked, I was going to build to that, but let's get into that. All right. So let's do it now. He voted against leadership. That was that's no, 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 no. That's he what you voted just said. For a tax increase. But you just said he voted against leadership. Which one do you want to discuss first? Well, he voted against 224 Republicans, including the entire leadership of this state. Right. And how many times did you vote against those Republicans? That's, not the, the well, that's no, not the issue. Well, that's not the issue. On this particular issue, on this particular issue, it's not the issue. No, no, no. We're talking about him voting for a tax increase. I never voted for a tax increase on anyone. And you pleasure never. You pleasure repeal the Bush tax cuts. Brooks has did never had a job, and you know it. And you will He's not, not a lawyer. What are you what? About? A lawyer? Yeah. He He's made fifty thousand dollars practicing law. At two hundred dollars an hour, he worked six weeks. Okay. He has been living off the taxpayer's pocket his whole life. Okay. He has never been in the free market. He has never. Well, you say you have a job. Me, a wait lawyer. a minute. Wait a minute. You're telling me he's a conservative? Yeah. How in the world you know? You, there's no way for you to know he's a conservative. How is that not he's true? Never, he's been an elected official he, this whole time. He's, he's just been said. elected. He's been a career politician. How do you know he's conservative? Wow. His How do record you know? says. He, what record? Well, uh, he's never been in the free market. He's been spending your money and my money. Uh, he's been a lawyer. That's a job. How's that not a job? Get a, get a break, man. Do some research before okay. you start telling right. people out here. All right. Explain that to me. He, so he's never held a job yet. He's, he's never been a held a job. He has been a career politician. But he's He's been a lawyer never been in the free market, and he espouses is, is the economics. Lawyer, is being a lawyer not a free market? Not for him it wasn't. How he so? was living off of his salary from the taxpayer. But he held a job. Your what what kind of job? Where was his office? His office was uh, in was downtown. His, what Huntsville. was his payroll? I have no idea what his payroll well, was. Why don't you find out? Well, what's it, what does it matter? It ma matters a whole lot. There are people listening, going to work every day that are trying to make a payroll and ends meet. Hold on a second. And we've got a politician in Washington telling people that he's an economist and he understands the free market. Well, he he's never been in it. But he, he, has an econ he is an economist. Is he an economist? But Guess what has got us in the most trouble in this country ever? Lawyers and economists. Really? Uh, uh, Those of us who have been in the trenches, I've been working since I was 12 years old. Mm -hmm. I signed notes that I, if I didn't yeah, make it, it could take that. me under. Mo Brooks has been living off the taxpayer. So you say he's, he's, a, he's a career, career politician. politician. He's right. a career politician. So what? What do you mean so And I've said on this program, and I know you listen, so I'll just tell you this. Okay. I've said on this program all the time, the argument that they're a career politician was used in 2008 and 2010 in the most absurd way against people who were good politicians. Who is the that? argument has to who be... Who is that? In every give race... Give an example. We're not, okay, you want me to give you a perfect example? Mo Brooks, if you're going to argue he's a career politician in 2010, Les what Phillips... What has Mo Brooks done as a career politician? Congressman Griffith, you just asked me a go question. Down on the, go down on his district in South Parkway and see if it's not beginning to look like a ghost town. What has he done while he was a commissioner? Go down on the South Parkway. The people it's beginning to look like North Parkway. They, what again, was his job? The people reelected him over and over and over again. Because he was giving their money back to them. He was taking money in the county commission and giving it back to them. They didn't realize it was their money. He was giving the taxpayers' money back to them and taking credit for it. Every county what has he done? 
every county commissioner does I'm not that exact about, thing. Listen, listen, Dale. You got to get it straight, good right, buddy. Lay it on me. This is what America is all about. It's jobs. Mm -hmm. It's jobs. He voted for a tax increase on middle class America. He voted to not extend the payroll tax cut. Okay. okay.